Hey guys, and welcome back to The Evil Within 2. When we last left off, well, we said goodbye to Sykes and uh, had to contend with this bitch, which is not going to be fantastic. Right, come on. Uh, get down. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Move, 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 move your ass. Good enough. Right, cool. Let's go down. Down, down, deeper run down. Come on, buddy. Let's go, let's go. I'm hoping we can eventually kill this fucker and be done with it. Oh, dear. Oh man, that is so not good. Well, at least she's providing us with cover. Oh god. Us. Okay, it's fine. Let's get our stealth on. Damn. Um, balls, and she's just rearranged the room. Bitch. It's almost like she doesn't want to find us. She, I mean, she could obviously find us whenever she wanted, but she's just. Fucking with us more than anything else. Can we not? Nope, there's nothing we can do with that. I've got to say, as well, I think her song that she sings. Shit, yep. Definitely not going that way. Yes, we're fucked. That song that she sings definitely uh, grates on you after a while. It becomes kind of irritating. <sighs> okay. Well, at least it saves... Saves us here. How the arse nuggets are we going to get past this, though? Uh, okay, well, I guess... We're going... How the fuck did you see me? I'm... Oh, great. I'm calling major bullshit on that. So now we've got to go the other way. God damn you, you bitch. It's okay. It's all good. It's all good. Each failure. Oh, it saved us there. Nice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Each failure is one less before we get to the end. How the fuck did... Wait, where even are we? we... Okay, I swear we just glitched through the wall there. In fact, something weird happened there because we got stuck on the wall and then all of a sudden we could move. God damn you. Okay, we've got another checkpoint. Oh, 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 oh. I do like the kind of idea that she's blatantly fucking with us. What? But we have to go this way, surely. Fuck you, bitch. Why is it after me? We're out. 
does it have to do with this place? Fuck you, I'm out. I don't know. But I'm not a super fan of these bits, I'm gonna be honest. I find them and her. Oh, hello. Incredibly irritating. Letter from the police chief. Oh, okay, that's a little bit unfair. I wouldn't say she's incredibly irritating, but she's annoying. Jim here, just a quick note to give you an update on the Castellanos Beacon situation. We're sending Sebastian in for mandatory counselling. The Beacon incident needs to be kept under wraps, and the good detective is our only loose end. While we have many operatives in KCPD... Uh, oh, we have many operatives in KCPD, but not enough to ensure total a total information blackout. Fortunately, our staff psych uh, psychologist is on the organization's payroll. Once we determine how much Castellanos knows, we can easily instill self-doubt through these sessions. When we're through with him, Sebastian won't know, won't be sure what he knows. See, this is annoying as well. Look, scroll wheel. Sometimes scrolls on these, sometimes doesn't. There we go. Um... When we're through with him, Sebastian won't be sure if what he saw, if what he witnessed at Beacon was real. Not that he needs much help. He's been stumbling through the assignments like a zombie. Poor son of a bitch is obviously having trouble dealing with whatever happened to him in there. I almost feel bad for him. I've known the guy for over a decade. It's like he's a different person now. But that's the price of progress. If you want to make an omelette, you've got to break an egg or two. James Van Kirk. Hmm... Kidman was right. Oh, hello. They are everywhere. They were right under my nose the entire time. Mm. Well, that's quite a horrific revelation. That's for sure. Another file. Ah. Torn psychological evaluation report, bottom. The top half of the paper has been torn off. To be kept on duty and observed, the information gained from his experience in STEM could be invaluable to the organisation. It has been posted uh, that STEM immersion can have long-lasting residual effects. Detective Castellanos is unique in that he entered and left STEM without standard preparation or memory rewrites. Re we could learn a lot about the mental repercussions of STEM use simply by letting him go about his business whilst we observe from a distance. I will continue to track Detective Castellanos' mental state via our mandatory therapy sessions and I will report any findings to the organisation on a weekly basis. That's really bad. That's harsh. Right. We're just going to... Okay. Uh, Damn. That's unfortunate. Mobius were using me as their guinea pig. Long lasting residual effects. They knew Stem would scar me like this. Yep. Yes, they did, my brother. And we fell for it, hook, line, and sinker. And you definitely fell for it. Ooh. This looks iffy. A way out? Yeah, um, I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, shit. Look at this. Oh, dear. That's interesting. Can't get us. Still here. Can't leave. Nothing changes. Well, well, well. My fault. It's all my fault. What the hell is this? Can't move on. Can't move. The source of my pain. Is me. The part of me still stuck in STEM. Never getting out. No. 
I'm wrong. I will get out. But without you. Oh man, that's what you call self therapy. That was cool. What was that? It felt different than the others. More real. Like something changed. I feel good. <laughs> nice. Welcome back, Sab. My trusty revolver. I haven't seen you in a long time. Nice. Finally free. Well, hopefully things are picking up for our old friend. Well, we're going to have that photographic slide. So, we've got a new gun. Definitely liking the idea of that. Oh, we have as well. The revolver. So what's the deal with the revolver then? Is it powerful? Sebastian's sidearm of choice. It's less accurate than the semi-automatic handgun, but it does more damage. It uses the same am ammunition. Nice. Okay. So it's less accurate, but eh. Hmm. Pump action shotgun. It's, oh, yeah. Twice the barrel, twice the buckshot. Yeah. All right, let's switch up to that then. The change type. We get five handguns in this game. That's pretty insane when you think about it. But that's pretty cool too. Okay. Now, from what I understand, that bit that we just saw there only shows up if you've collected. Oh, we're back now. That only shows up if you've collected the right um, documents. Because believe it or not, you can miss that, I believe. But we haven't. So we're all good. Well, he holds the revolver with one hand. That's kind of strange. Yeah, you can see him kind of swaying all over with that. Maybe we'll upgrade it. Might be worth it. I wonder if now we've freed ourselves from all that guilt and misery. I wonder... Oh, we would have missed all of that if I missed that as well. God damn. Uh, I wonder if now he's freed himself from that, we will stop having that woman chase us. I guess one way to find out. Oh, hello. Yes. 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 Holds 12 shots. Not too shabby. That's so weird the way he holds it with one hand. Um, also, let's have our... Tr no. Let's try this for size. Let's give this a good old try. Alright, onwards and upwards, I guess. Well, this is a bloody maze, isn't it? Oh, man. More shotgun cartridges. Don't mind if I do. Can use as many of those bad boys as we can get. I like these. I like the fact they're red. That's cool. I don't know why, but that pleases me. Oh, dear. Oh dearie me, there's a lot of weird things in here. Can't really flush a skeleton down the sink. I mean, you certainly tried, obviously, but I don't think that would work too well. I'm curious at this little fellow. Not that little fellow. The other one. This fellow here. Oh, it's one of those dog things. Well... Quite the ugly number, but you know, you know, not not everything can be beautiful, I suppose. You know, we haven't found any rifle ammo, have we? I'm assuming rifle ammo can only be manufactured. Oh, I don't like the fact that that's there. Oh, my boss sense is tingling. Oh, my boss sense is tingling. Let's examine this place before we flip that switch. 
There's another one. Guys. Voices. Definitely voices. Guys. My boss sense is going off the charts. Should we flick the switch, see what happens? Emergency fire, pull down. Oh boy. We're going to be fighting flamethrower guy, aren't we? Oh, we're going to be fighting flamethrower guy. I would say so. A harbinger. Alright, well. Let's do it. Oh dear. Stand back. No, he doesn't know what he's doing. Well. Ooh. Liam, don't. What do you mean, Liam? Stay Work it out, buddy. Uh. Oh, he's not completely evil. Hey, buddy. Let's Stay see it. My way, oh. O'Neill, what happened? Theodore showed me the way. I am his now. Uh oh. I helped him hide. And in exchange, he gave me a new life. A life as a slave. You'll never understand. For that, you'll burn! Oh, I don't think so, buddy boy. I'm close to getting my next power, and you look like you're just enough XP. Gotta put the flames out. Oh God! Right, let's go. Let's go. How do you like that, my friend? Oh man, that was a nice little killer combo. Hey, buddy. Oh, dear. That's going to hurt. <laughs> Laugh it up, my friend. Laugh it up. You're not going to be laughing for too long. Oh, it does fire both shells at once. Okay. Good to know, I guess. Ah, oh, you fucker. Oh. That was cool. That was fucking cool the way he killed us. Flamethrower right in the guts. And then good night, Vienna. Okay. This is going to be a bit of a bastard. Damn. Yes, Sebastian. Right, okay. Let's turn that on. Oh boy. I think I'm too what to fight you? Oh, that was nice. That was extremely nice. Don't let him get too close now. Keep moving. Am I now? Are you sure? Ah, shit. Um, what do we have? What do we have? Got these. You are going to let me get away, my friend. Because that's just the way it's going to be. Do we have any ammo? We've got the silence hang on, I suppose. Let the planes consume you. No. No, I'd rather they didn't, thank you. If it's quite alright. Actually, buddy, I'm pretty sure, just between us, I am going to escape you. 
pretty sure, my friend, that that is definitely going to happen. And pretty sure you're going to be dead. Ooh, we still have this gun. Our original handgun. Oh. I didn't realize we were playing. I thought we were fighting. Like men. Ooh, okay. Right, let's get this going. Let's put the damn fire out. Yes, Father Theodore. I told him. Ouch. Yeah, there, buddy. Yeah, I can see that. Yep, well. I know the feeling, buddy. But it's going to be me cleansing you. And how we're going to laugh once you're dead. We're going to live it up once you're gone, my friend. No one will even remember you. Now, why do I get the small inkling, guys, that not one shot of that hit him? Come on, pick it up, pick it up! Oh, God. Those animations take way too long. Pretty sure we had that problem in the first game as well. Oh, oh, here he goes. See, that was hitting him. So, yeah, we basically just fired our six shots into the wind. Uh, I am seriously not a fan of that shotgun either. I won't let him get away. I promise. Oh, God. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, Sebastian. No, Sebastian. You serious? You don't deserve Okay. One hit kill when it gets close to you. Now, do we have to do that entire endeavor again? In all fairness, he's... N yeah, we do. Uh, right, and... No, I didn't want to... I didn't... What? I didn't... I didn't go anywhere near the door. I went to pick up the ammo. Ouch. Damn it, and this is off to an awful start. And... Oof, God. Okay, grab. Yeah, seriously not a f Oh, the ammo's disappeared. Oh, shit. I see what you mean. There's fire everywhere. Yeah, we're dead. You know what? I don't mind. Let's just die and start that again. Because that was bad. Missed way too many shots. Right, let's try and pick up the shotgun shells this time without it activating the boss. See what was so hard about that game. Now, is there anything else around here to grab? It could be very nice. It doesn't look like it. Oh boy. Right, well. I guess it is what it is. Let's rejig a few things um, definitely don't want that we want that as a second weapon oh, we could actually manufacture some stuff but it co yeah it just it costs way more than it should they almost double everything I don't think the harpoons are going to be any good either, because they're fire, and I'm pretty sure these guys are immune to fire. I mean, it doesn't say that they are, but I think that's fairly logical. Um, let's have that as three. And we'll prime that with explosive bolts. You know what, let's just use our explosive bolts because we massively upgraded these things. Yeah, okay, they hurt quite a lot more. You shouldn't really be scared of me. We were friends, remember? Uh, 
Okay, this is, I hope, going quite well. Right, that's empty. Oh, nice. Yes! That's the ticket. That's it! I'm done playing with you! I'm guessing we're gonna get his swaggy flamethrower after this. Oh. Uh, I'm not actually technically running from you, bud. Run! Nope, 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 nope. Health. Okay, could have been worse, guys. Okay, that was pretty bad. Run! Ouch! You did, actually. But it's okay, because I'm going to hurt you quite a lot too. So, you know, swings and roundabouts. Run! How's it feel, buddy? How's it feel? Ooh. Oh, it's definitely going to stop you. It usually does! Shotgun. Severely depleted. Yes! Well, that wasn't so bad, was it? I never really did like you. Thank you, Sebastian. You're welcome. Stop him. I can't stop him if I can't find him, O'Neill. He face shifted. He's not here. Not anywhere. What? There's a machine in the room next door. You've got to destroy it. What machine? He made me build it. To hide him. Destroy it. So that you can destroy him. Damn, bro. That we can do. What happened? How did O'Neill get turned Ooh, into that thing? That looks like a flame, bro. I've been locked in my safe house since you left. When Liam called and asked me to meet him, I was so relieved to hear his voice. But he wasn't Liam. He was that thing. I tried to get through to him, but you heard him. Theodore Wallace did something to him. Poor guy. I didn't want to have to kill him. You didn't have a choice. Theodore wasn't going to give him up. So what now? Let's take a look at this machine O'Neill was talking about. I think it's on the other side of the room where you found us. Let's go. Right you are, young lady. Okay, search the back room. But first, broken. Ah, god damn it. This flamethrower's fuel tanks are damaged beyond repair. You'll need to find some replacements before you can use it. We have a couple of replacements. The weapon seems to use custom-made parts, so you'll probably need to find a similar weapon to salvage the tanks from. You have a feeling that you're not going to find one just lying around, though. Well, no. I could use this, but it's broken. If I found the right parts. Yeah, we have all of the parts. Don't you worry about it, Sebastian. Everything is under control. Right, let's go. Oh. Oh. Sadly, we didn't get any green gel from him. Never disobey. Of course I will. Whatever pleases 
Wow, Yukiko. I don't want to upset you, but your friend wanted to burn you to death. How does that make you feel? Pretty shitty, I'd wager. Influence. Theodore's sticking his fingers in every part of this place. It's almost like a form of communication with him. Hmm. Yes, yes it is. Lots of weird stuff in here. Looks like he was building something. Well, he's already told us. Yes, maybe indeed. Right, let's go through the looking glass anyway, guys. Oh, didn't we get another slide? The answer to that is yes. Yes, we did. Oh, sweet. Okay, so we still do have a chance to get this, all the slides. Kidman, come in. Ever get the feeling you don't know what's real anymore? More than most people. Although probably not as much as you. The first time I was inside STEM, I didn't know I was in it. Even when I got out, I was never totally sure that I'd ever left. And when I tried to explain what happened... People told you you were crazy. Of course. If someone came to me with my story, I'd have them committed for their own protection. <laughs> That's why you stayed out this time? I don't ever want to go back into STEM again if I can avoid it. Consider yourself lucky. Union is like having deja vu in the middle of a dream about deja vu. <laughs> I hope I can make it out of here with my mind intact. I just hope you make it out of there, period. Well, yeah. I'm not sure anyone gets out with their mind completely intact. STEM marks you in ways that I think no one's aware of yet. You're not wrong, Kidman. You're not wrong. Still, I'm starting to trust you. Oh, come on. We're so close, man. Like, one more enemy will give us enough XP. Uh, or green gel to get what we want. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end the video there. Thank you very much for watching. When we return, we're going to continue to destroy the machine that uh, old O'Neill left us. And hopefully, we're about to repair our fucking flamethrower. Yeah, that's right. Flamethrower. Hopefully, we're in for a good time. See you next time, guys.